Welcome back. Many veterans returning from combat struggle with the things they saw, felt, and endured while fighting for our freedoms. Yeah, for sure. A volunteer group of men and women are working quietly to help veterans by honoring them with quilts of valor. Channel 6's Barry Roy shares one woman's mission to help as many as she can before it's too late. Good evening to you, Barry. Yeah, good evening to you both. Quilts of Valor began in 2003, and its mission is to cover as many service members and veterans touched by war with comforting and healing quilts of valor. One local woman is taking up the challenge every single day, one stitch at a time. The hum of a long arm sewing machine is music to the ears of Stacy Clady. This side's not lined up with the edge of the blue tape. There we go. Who works meticulously every morning and afternoon to make quilts of valor for veterans all across the country. You always have those very patriotic American thoughts and um, you think about the soldier that that's going to be wrapped around at some point and, and what it's going to mean to him or her. For Stacy, she's a former military spouse. Her husband Tom served in the Army for 27 years and went all over the country calling 15 duty stations home including Fort Hood twice. And now she's a military mom, her son Paul, who is now stationed at Fort Riley, Kansas, following in his father's footsteps. I sewed clothes as a little girl. Quilts of valor are made by hand, every stitch counted, measured, and carefully placed because some veterans, Stacy says, have no one to talk to, hold, or hug in that moment of real need. You know, you think of the, the veterans being by themselves, and that's so sad that they took care of our country and that our country doesn't always take care of them. Um, so to be able to be a small part of letting them know that, that they were appreciated and that we're still thinking of them. Casey says today Quilts of Valor has awarded nearly 220,000 veterans, soldiers and service members and ceremonies across the country, but she says it's not enough. It just makes you happy. You, you just feel like I was just a part of something good and it will stay with me and it will stay with that veteran. Neither one of us will ever forget. And so she continues for the veterans that maybe she'll never meet. Quilts of Valor, we do a lot of stars. One stitch at a time. Chris and Leslie Stacy calls her local group a ragtag bunch, but she's so proud of their work. For more information on this story, how to help, or if you'd like to become a member of their team, we have all that information up on our website, KCNTV.com. Yeah, a lot of red, white, and blue, a lot of stars and stripes. <laughs>